Do you think that with these babies that I can do a hairdo? Haha, <laughs> I can! You guys, Justin McClellan here. I wanna make this like light and just chill factor for all of you. When I get ready, I like to do it on my, my, my floor. In front of a mirror, on the floor, chill. I got my denim. This is when we know that we're chill. So I'm gonna bring to you a style using these babies and a tight curl. So here we go. <laughs> The other day, my niece who has hair that is just long as could be, she told me about how she watched a YouTube video and they took pencils and they wound the pencils in the hair and then they took their flat iron. This is something that isn't, I, I wouldn't do this all the time, but it's super fun. And since I wash my hair every three days, I'm gonna film a little something for you on day two hair two. So you're gonna wait for the, that video to be coming as well. So when you're watching this, you're like, oh, there's a second part to this sucker? Why, yes, there is. So watch out for that. But pencils, idea, whoever thought of this, you're brilliant. We're gonna make music today. <laughs> All right, this is seriously so easy, but I wanna make sure that I tell you guys, you're gonna wanna do your dry shampoo before, let it dry completely, because we want this to last as long as possible. So brush, hair, this baby, and hairspray, that's it. Okay, I'm gonna get ready. I'm just gonna, we're, we're just sitting on the floor. Easy peasy, so enjoy, have fun, here we go. All right, first, dry shampoo. You want this puppy to last. Now, to be completely honest with you, I filmed another tutorial today. So my hair has a light curl to it, but this is day one hair. And we're gonna pull the hair up, and we're gonna start out down low. Now, you don't have to do all of this down here. What I do recommend though, up, at right, like right now, is making sure you're just adding a curl to this. Okay, so we just wanna get a curl, a good curl. All through. And this way it's not, I mean, cause I have short hair and it's hard to get those underside pieces. If I had longer hair, I'd probably just roll out with the whole entire pencil look. But because I'm rocking a short hairstyle, that's why I'm just curling this bottom part really, really well and um, making it tighter. So there, people really aren't going to see that I have this curled, but it just, it's gonna look a little indeed and more curled. Okay, so we have that part done. We're gonna do the next level. And this is where I brought a, like more than one pencil, you can do it with one. If all you have is one, then you can do one. But I'm not taking too big of sections. I need to make sure they're not too wide, which these are not. So that's about an inch, maybe less, right there. So I'm gonna have really good just sections like so with these, okay? All right, so pull this baby up. This is definitely one that you wanna part off, for sure. And the other thing that you wanna make sure that you do before you start is to brush out your piece. Okay, we're gonna take a section and we're gonna wrap it with the pencil. Now, if you, there's two, there's different ways that you can do this which is gonna give you a completely different curl. I experimented with this and if you did everything flat, that's gonna be a way different curl than if you kind of Twist the, the top just a bit, and then get it rolled down. Okay, so this is more of a rope wrap instead of a flat wrap. Flat wrap. Then you're gonna take this, and you're just gonna scrunch it right along there. Then I'm gonna move it kind of like so. Move it again so that heat is getting on every section. And then get the top really well. Okay, and then I'm going to just let that kind of sit and do its thing and move to the next one. So that allows, allows the, it to, to kind of stay and keep the curl and lose the heat. 
Okay, again. Isn't this crazy? Whoever came up with this is, I'm mind blown, mind blown. But it's really, really cool. This is gonna take me a while. Like this is not something that I would do every day, but that's why we wanna make sure we get it to last because it isn't something that you do every day. So we're talking like if you have a fun party to go to, if you need to dress up for something, if you want, I don't know, sky's the limit, but it's just something fun. If you got downtime and you're like, let's play their hair, do our makeup, whatever, this baby. So make sure you rotate that pencil just a bit. Don't just keep it one area the whole time. You need to rotate it. Okay, and then you keep that there. You can take that one out if you want. It's still a little warm. So that's why I have three, three of these babies. Okay, so I have these three sitting here. And then of course I'll just pull out one and continue to go around somewhere else. So I'm going to continue to do this. I'll come talk to you in a bit. Look at that curl. Look at that. Such a tight little wave. Like it's legit this wave going on. Such a soft, I mean, it's just awesome. It's different than anything else I've seen before. And if you wanna get these front pieces too so that they show, but by the time we get up to the top, it's gonna to be fine and I think you're gonna like it just fine. So let's continue to do this. I'm just gonna do it on my floor to my mirror and let's have some fun. going on here. Look at these pencil curls. Nice, look at that wave. It is so beautiful, such a tight wave. It's almost kind of got a crimped look to it, but more of a wave. I love it. See, short hair can have fun. We can have fun. Here we go some more. Stretch in between, stretch things out. It takes a little bit of time. I ain't gonna lie, I ain't gonna lie. We're almost done though. We're at the tail end of this baby. final pieces. I should have timed myself for how long this tip this took. It's a few seconds. A, like, a, like a thousand few seconds? Maybe? But we are down to the nitty gritty at the very end. So I'm trying to get as much volume right here on the top for these, these tight curls. And then um, I'll do one more in the front because I want it to be boss like this little one you see right there. But um, I'm digging it, you guys. I think it's gonna be fun. I'm gonna try and get some good volume and then stay tuned for the next video that you will see because I'm gonna do a part two to this and show you like, okay, day two, how did my hair you know, go? I'll try really hard not to get in a steam shower or a shower or, luckily I don't live in a humid place right now. And we'll get this in. So we're just gonna leave that there. Pull out this one. What? Yeah, baby. The last piece. Can I get a what, what? Okay, here we go. Bring it tight. Cause 
we want this curl to stay. If you hear that little whistle, that's my AC on, in, in case you're wondering. It's hard to get it to that front piece, so I'm gonna take out this one so that pencil is in my way so you can get up there as tight as possible. Don't forget to spin your pencil, wrap it around a bit, making sure you're getting all the points for that curl. We got her. Gotta get it good, because it's the front piece. It's so matte to my head for me right now. I kind of feel like a drowned rat. <laughs> so I'm gonna have to, I don't have that volume I'm used to. So I'm gonna have to really amp this up. So I will be letting loose of this. I'm not gonna be keeping it very tight like this. If you have a little girl that you really wanted to keep it in tight, you totally could. But I am gonna be, I need, I need volume. I need volume. So that's gonna go. So we'll take this one out. Oh yeah, and then, oh, okay, wait, I need a hair product. I need a hair product, hold tight. Okay, so this baby, this right here, this is marula oil. This is what you've seen me use in a lot of my hair tutorials, so I'll get it on my hands so my hands aren't dry. And then I'm gonna come through here, I'm gonna come up underneath it, and I'm just gonna pop it like this. And see how that already is loosening things up? And then if there's any more that I have to go in and do, oh my gosh! Look at just the volume that added just by going like that. You see that? Woo! I love this! It's so cute! It's so cute. Okay, I'm gonna loosen it up a bit more. Oh my gosh, I am dying. This is so fun. Get that volume. Oh, AC just turned off. Okay, see the difference in the two sides? Just by doing that, so let's do the other side. Get some of my ends too. Come up under, loose that up. Oh my gosh. This is so cute. I absolutely love this. Get it on the ends, kind of scrunch it up. <sighs> okay, that was worth it. That was worth it. Straight up. You see the back? How we look good. I'm gonna have to, I'm gonna have to explore and see what the back looks like and see if there's any pieces I need to do. Oh, I love it. Okay, now one last thing I'm going to do is I want this to stay put. So I'm gonna take my hairspray up underneath. I'm gonna spray this, kind of scrunch it. See, you can't even see those curls that we did earlier, that they're like actual curls and not these. Okay, so go up underneath. I'm dying, I love this. I wish I could do this to my hair every day. And now you have just that tight, Curl, like it almost looks like it's a natural curl for girls that have natural curly hair that you're trying to really achieve. And there we go, guys. I'm digging this. What do you think? So I wanna know what you guys think of this. Is this something that you would do with your hair? Cause I think you should. I'm more ecstatic now than I ever was before. I could even get more volume than this if I really wanted to. Um, we'll see what I do tomorrow. And you'll see that in another video. I'm not gonna hook it to this one. I'm gonna see another video. So you better go find out and see how much these curls stay for tomorrow. All right, you guys, Jocelyn McClellan with Fit Mission Makeup. You can find me on Instagram. You can see all kinds of stories that I do there at jocelyn.mcclellan. Also look in the descriptions below because I'll have links to everything there. But Instagram, Facebook, Fit Mission Makeup with Jocelyn McClellan. I do live tutorials on Tuesdays and Thursdays. You can find me on Pinterest. You can find me on my website, fitmissionmakeup.com. You're set, but I hope that you love this tutorial. We had fun with this one. This one was different, right? Yep, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. We had fun with this one. All right, guys, take care. We'll see you next time, bye.